Hey Mike. What's up boys and girls? How are you? Doing well, thank you. <laughs> Good morning. It's really cold today. Really, really cold. Everyone's been saying it. But we're about to go check and see if the top pool is filled. So we've been doing loads of restoration work on it. Ooh. It's not windy. Look at that glass. Nice. Look at that weird ass bird. What the hell is that Got a little bit more to go. Yeah, we'll be able to ride it in a couple hours, I reckon. We can honestly probably ride it like this. We just keep filling it up <laughs> as we go. It's only a little ollie. Oh, that wind is freezing. Well, I'm missing a trick here. Don't break it. What is this? Oh no. <laughs> what the hell is this? So, in true Peacock Brothers style, we, we've driven all the way out to the back lake and neither of us can figure out how, <laughs> how to get the petrol thingy open <laughs> to pour petrol into the generator. So currently, that was a wasted journey unless we can figure out how the petrol can opens. Hey, we did it. Fill that puppy up and let's get her going. We need to ride. Boy. Woo! All right, generator is on. We are gonna come back and check on that in a bit. Right now, we're gonna head back to the house, chill for a little bit. Hopefully it warms up. We've got three videos to film today. We're gonna get them done. So hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned because we have a load of crazy videos coming your way. <laughs> Yo, we got the fun board. We had to send it on the lake. Fun board style. We are oh, well and truly loaded up. It is so hot back here. We got wakeboards, fun board, Orion and the twins in the car. And we are going for a fun board sesh. We're super hyped to ride this thing. It looks like so much fun, clues in the name. It does look fun to be fair. When they first came out with the board, I saw it and I remember I was at a Water Sports World dealer day and I said to Scott Taylor and Nick Green, I was like, boys, please, can you get me one of them? They look so fun, but they refused. So now that we're out here, what better chance to hop on this bad boy Ooh, looks fun. Took the fins out because obviously we don't want to snap them on the rails. And let's go and have a sick session. Let's set this bad boy up. So we're back out at the dealer cable. The buy level is still Look filling up. Thing. Look at that. That's a board. That looks like a whole lot of fun. That does look like a whole lot of fun. Come on then, get ch change your boots over and let's go. All right, let's go do on. it. Look, time's running out. Fucking a directional board going all direction. It's actually like Eric designed by Eric. Eric you show us that, hold it up. I'm gonna go out for the first sesh on the fun board. I'm super stoked to check this thing out. Gonna send you up to the sky on the drone, I think right now. Ryan's gonna get some clips and then we're gonna switch it over so Let's get this session underway. Cue the music. Let's go. Whilst I'm waiting for Josh to come out, 
on the fun board, I decided that I would talk you guys a little bit through what makes this board so special and why we can't throw down exactly what we'd normally be able to. So the fun board is basically a directional board. It actually comes with, when we had it, it was one fin on the back, but I think you can even put three fins in and it's designed to take wakeboarding back to its roots of the Skurfer one-way directional boards. And it's pretty fun to be honest. Obviously we can't throw down everything we normally would be able to. We're gonna show you how fun this board is and I think if anyone that actually understands wakeboarding and where it came from can appreciate how fun it is to hop on this thing and go for a carving session it's pretty much become quite a big thing in snowboarding these days to hop on and just go for some cruisy calves and that is definitely what this board targets so well and taking it out on the rails is just stepping it up that bit further so we got the bindings right at the back of the board and we're cruising around trying to do as much as we can but landing right foot forward or left foot whichever way is fakey on this board really is pretty scary but such good fun and hopefully now we're going to get some more clips of the boys so enjoy hit that subscribe button and uh yeah check out the rest of the video sit tight there's way more to come <laughs> fun is that? Yeah, this thing is weird, it's so sick, but it feels like you're riding a plank of four before. <laughs> four. <laughs> Pretty stoked on the roll blind. Did not at all think that I was going to land that, but let's maybe do one more rally for the road. That is going to be it from us today. Ryan's over there, super naked, getting changed right now. We're going to be filming on the bi level tomorrow, so you guys do not want to miss that. Make sure you smash that subscribe button and leave us a thumbs up because we got some big plans coming. Yeah, hit us up if you know what we should do in England. We're gonna be back there on Sunday, which is in a couple days time, actually Monday morning, but it's gonna be good to get home again. I'm back for a couple weeks. Ryan's back for about a week and a half and then we are heading out to Argentina for the World Championships. So that should be a fun one. That's Team GB, always exciting out there with them. Yeah, basically that concludes our day. I know Liam just chatted a load. Nah, that's it. We uh, had a pretty fun day today. Anyways, we're going to head to the bi level tomorrow morning, I do believe. We've got a full day out there, so yeah. hopefully going to film a load of videos for you guys. And apart from that, yeah, we've got, we got some good things going on right now. We're going to keep you guys updated as we go along. <laughs> you know one thing which really makes me laugh when you do an outro? I can't end it, can I? You can't. You just keep going I round and round to, in circles. I don't want it to end, mate. Yes, like... that's it from us. Make sure you catch us in the next video. Bye. <laughs>